Welcome back to Super Brothers, where we're taking on the what we believe is the Bright Moon. Oh, we gotta fight this guy again. Okay. I think it's the Bright Moon. But he's pretty easy. going see the tu the fight's got a little tougher a nice touch a triple a little different Lost my chance. I'm ready. Stop. Boom. Success. Now let's get the fuck out of here. I think it's a little more flowery than I remember. So we'll see what the huntsman and the girl have to or the logsman or the woodsman. Yeah, I felt like these were really black at the zero moon. It was just like pure black logs. Now there's like a little yellow on top of them grass or moss. Need to sprint. Hi ho, hi ho, adventuring we go. We've got the mega book and the key I think. So anyways, now that we've arrived in the cottage place, we will question them about their dreams. Their very dreams! Like a reflection in the water, a parallel reality of existence. The woodsman admitted that his dog seemed to go a bit mental whenever the bright moon loomed in the sky above. You know, you don't really have much to say either. Uh, yeah, go fuck yourself. The girl spoke of her dream walking in the woods in the hour before dawn, with the bright moon looming in the sky above. She spoke of a crisp morning air in an impossible island in the midst of a placid lake. Interesting. So let's check this out. And then we'll go to Sleepy Time Land. Stupid sheep. Oh, so we got some sheep over here. Music seems a little louder over here, so maybe we're supposed to get through here at this moment. Looks all the same. Let's talk to the wolfster. See what he has to say. That was pathetic. All right. No one has anything new to say. Let's just go to Dreamy Time Land. Get your jog on. The giant record. A few sheep. Little skippity skippity skippers. I 
Alright. Move it, rabbit. This ain't no tea party. Oh, did I miss it? Yep. Click. Orion's belt. I think these stars actually might be accurate. See? Uh, well, this, this too. Who knows? But that would be a cool feature if the stars were actually accurate. Very good. Ooh, that's new. Some crazy creature. That beckons us forward. Actually, I want to check out the, uh... The guy on the left. That's clearly from the right. Dash down those stairs. He exists. Oh, and there's that. Let's have a chitty chatter. He's kind of... While the bright moon looms, we met a mysterious musical fellow besides a crackling fire, who introduced himself as Jim Guthrie. Critical fact. Oh. Oh. Huh, huh. Huh, huh, huh. Huh, 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 huh. Oh, fuck. Da da. Okay. It didn't make me redo that note. I'm cool with it. Thanks, Jim. Couldn't have done it without your help. The bright moon looms, and we just woke a sylvan sprite in a hidden grove where Jim Guthrie happened to be hanging out. I wonder if that would have happened if I didn't reveal his name by talking to him. And he changed his tune. Come on, let me go. It sounds like a power up or level up when you get things run away. Oh, a duckaroo. Oh, come on. Duck. Huh? Trees? Rabbits. Higher up the sky. Anything? Is it clicker then? Oh. Oh, guide the ducks to their mother. Oh. Help the spirit. Oh. That's two. Oh, music changed. The bright moon looms, and we just woke a sylvan sprite from its still waters of a lake where the mother duck was freaking out. That's quite a, a change. Flat. We're gonna have to do something with the reflection finally, which I was like, I knew this has been coming up. So the moon is the same. Maybe not. Oh, no, it's just a bush. Oh, the same ones over here? Oh, 
I did it. I don't know what I did, but I did it. Huzzah! The bright moon looms and we woke a sylvan sprite where the lake's reflection was ever so slightly incur in congruous. Oh, that bush is not there. I did not notice that. That was totally random. Ooh, these owls. That's fun. They will probably play into this. Easy. Easy money. One to go. Bright moon looms, and we woke the sprite who slumbered in the lake beneath a trifecta of owls. Alright, let's get out of here. Seizure warning. If you have epilepsy, prepare to look away from the screen. What you are about to see otherwise is a bright flashing of colors. In other news, we're back here with our doggy. Woof. What's going on, Woofster? Oh, he's going over there. Woof! Oh, can I talk to him? Alright. Oh, we got it over there. Uh, those are just glowy spots. I don't think there'd be bubbles. So outside the tree, there hasn't been one there yet. Yep, there we go. We will reveal the dog's dream. Or something like that. Hi. No? Oh, trees? Oh, in the right order. Oh, Won the day. Woof woof. The bright moon looms, and we just woke a sylvan sprite lurking at the root of a titanic tree. We got that feeling that it was maybe just maybe a time of miracles. Okay, Wolfster, where next? Into the tree? Okay. Or should I try my thing? Nope. He's like, go here. But this is just something this guy. Let's see if he has something new to say. A new solitary grave and badass ghost showed up. Look for a signal from the Sylvan Sprites, and sing a song of sorcery there to reveal a hidden Trigon. It's kind of old info. He's just gonna chill in the tree, I guess. It's his shtick. Okay, is this area accessible this time? Oh, not really. Could try some old bullshit with my uh, sorceriness. But I don't, it's not really indicating that. Let's not waste my time. Oh, Wolfster. How did he lap me like that? Okay. Okay, boy, I'll go in. I 
Off with the belt, and off with the boots. Thus I returned and left immediately. Alright, possible update. Oh, this guy. So it seems you've made a significant amount of progress in your effort to locate and tame the Bright Moon Trigon. Very nicely done. If you're monitoring actions, we'd like to point out that the longer the hesitation, the smaller the Okay. There's a saying up here in the Caucasus that a forest needs a fire like a fire needs a tree. And the wolfster. Bark, bark, bark. I agree, boy. Any comments? The girl remarked upon the growing moon. She wondered how long it would be until the bright moon loomed in the sky. So we're not... So we're in regular moon times again. Woodsman said that he never used to think all that much about the Gogolithic mass in the mountain wilderness of Migital. However, in the last little while, he said that the spectral presence of the mass has started to haunt him. Ebijibis and the Dark Moon. Hmm. Uh, what do you think about blood sports? Everyone likes blood sports, right? I, I heard that uh, there's so buildings. Down my there. guess here. Um, Actually, this uh, place oh. to see people get killed by animals, beasts, and stuff. That sounds neat. So I forget. I think the miracle's supposed to happen within the dream world. So I found everything. So that's pointless. I need to reactivate the... Whatever it was, and try to see if that miracle is going to happen. Probably solve all of these, then go back, do the crescent moon phases. Damn you, changing moon! Alright. Fuck out of here. Probably fight the thing again. Oh no, I need to fight the thing again. Thank you. 
Get some exciting gameplay. <sighs> Hello. Let's do it. One more. Is he declaring three attacks? Very good. To sleep. There we are. At least it doesn't attack me twice here. Through the wall, past the nest thing. Hello, everyone. I'll just be heading inside for a little nappy poo. And I am going to sit on the left one. trick is we gotta find all the sprites are there just need to find the miracle so let's check I'm gonna try the back side See if this place has anything going on. Just gonna brute force this. Um. Nope. Unless it's some weird thing where I have to, like, use the mushroom in the right area. Which I'll probably never figure out on my own, so hopefully it's simpler. Hello, owls? Back where we found the dog, and of course the regular seizure warning. Oh, no seizure! Interesting! And this will be a little portal I can walk on and teleport away. Let's do it. 
raise your sword upon high and be teleported away. Oh, I gotta right click it. Haja! If we can do something like this. Interesting. Raise the moon up to its height. So I can't go left or right. Oh, just reverse it. Reversing the moons. And now I probably have to uh, fight a uh, triangle. Magic. Oh, is this the triangle of death? It is the most deadly triangle known to man. And I'll have to fight him inside his triangle house. Which is shaped like a square. Alright. So before the water rises and causes us the trouble, we'll fight him in the next episode. So catch y'all then.